hello youtube so let me come to the point directly so i'm gonna sell this fnd t60x system in next few days so thought of making long term review and pros and cons of this system and why i'm selling this system now i'm selling this system because uh, i want to try something new for you guys so that i can keep making videos at the same time this system is loud and punchy but uh, you know my taste of music i listen to this type of uh, decaf songs so this system honestly is not meant for that kind of songs this this system is meant for party songs like trance or bollywood songs which have fast and punchy bass so i removed these covers today from the subwoofers because uh, whenever i do the research i mainly focus on the subwoofers and those who have knowledge uh, they will understand uh, <coughs> how is the performance of subwoofers from its movement and the amount of uh, air they can move so you must have seen into the pro audio the movement of subwoofer is uh, very less but the sensitivity is very high that means they are very loud these are kind of that that kind of subwoofers and the stiffness is pretty high for for this subwoofers and the x mass is not that high okay so these are meant to be loud at uh, mid bass frequency or i can say upper bass frequency around 70 80 hertz but that is not my purpose and uh, i don't enjoy that kind of bass that's why i'm going to shoot this video with a with a closer view of the subwoofers so that you can get the really good idea on the main unit i kept bass on plus plus 5 and treble on minus 5 so that uh, if i play some decaf music uh, i won't get any kind of copyright so stay tuned guys this will be the sound test and the real sound test on youtube no one does this kind of sound test because this kind of bass is premium expensive only logitech jbl this kind of brands clips deron polcordio this kind of brands can reproduce that kind of bass i am not expecting that kind of bass from this system but trust me guys for the price this system is definitely worth it i will never complain even though it is a chinese brand but they have very good knowledge of engineering audio engineering i would say so now let me start the sound test so the camera is set lights on now i will play some decaf music hope i won't get any copyright maybe because of this small room and uh, this room is not designed acoustically and i have 
have vitrified tiles maybe that you know that can be the reason but uh, the low frequency base uh, is not that impressive for this system but if you keep it in a big room uh, the low base will be really noticeable and pretty good not bad there should be lots of furniture lots of uh, sound absorbing material in the room then you will enjoy the base now let me play some other song So I am not uh, increasing the volume over 50 percent. I never abuse my system. That's why I have, uh, this volume, this performance is on 50 percent volume. Let me try the last song. I will play some song from my playlist itself. So these are eight inch subwoofers.
the flats. Flats for bubbles. Now I will increase the volume. Any system sounds perfect when you keep the EQ on the flat. Okay, so on the flat the performance is little better and well balanced. So this was my review on FND T60X. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, these tower speakers are really good and loudest in the category for the price. Okay, in this price range these are the loudest and most cleanest sounding uh, <coughs> tower speakers. And after this, I am going to try something which has better low bass than this. Please stay tuned and subscribe to my channel. I keep uploading and enhancing my knowledge and sharing my knowledge regarding the audio. So thanks for watching. Stay tuned. Live loud.